In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a quality connection to standard headers from regular wires to a header like this. And the connection will be a mechanical and a soldering connection. For this operation, it might be best to use extra hands. Extra hands is generally just a, a device that has two alligator clips on it, and you can use it to hold your pieces while you're soldering. And I'm going to put the, the header into one of the alligator clips and I'm putting it all the way down so it doesn't wiggle. To make the mechanical connection, first you have to strip some wire. And I've stripped about half of an inch or about 13 millimeters. For the mechanical connection, I just take a wire. I wrap it around one of the leads. So you take a wire that has a good amount of insulation that, that has been stripped and you just make a U and then you wrap it around again. And then you simply solder it after you get the wire wrapped around. You only want to touch this wire very quickly and you only want a very little amount of solder on here. And the reason for that is because the heat shrink that's on here can shrink from the heat of the wire. And take your side snips and just snip off the extra wire on the end. You'll need to bend up the wire so you can get the heat shrink on the entire metal portion of it. There. Now the heat shrink is covering the wire and the soldered part of it and the lead from the header. And once this is shrunk, a heat shrunk, it will cause less strain on the wire at this point and this will last a very long time and it'll be very tough. Here's how this particular part of the assembly looks after it's been soldered, uh, the wire attached and the heat shrink added and heated. And this is how it may look after four wires are added and this is actually a part of a, a ribbon cable. 